close. Yes, this is a very special episode, everyone. Today, since it's wizard themed, we're gonna read a story about the wizard, and the most famous story about the wizard is probably Harry Potter. So we're gonna read maybe not the most famous of his books, but Harry Potter and the portrait of what looked to be a large pile of ash. Not large. A large pile of ass. A large pile of ash. <laughs> That's what I said. Okay, let's jump in. First chapter. The handsome one. I mean, I mean a close up one as well. Like. The castle grounds snarled with a wave of magically magnified wind. The sky outside was a great black ceiling, which was full of blood. <laughs> The only sounds drifting from Hagrid's hut were the disdainful shrieks of his own furniture. Magic it was something that Harry Potter thought was very good. Leathery sheets of rain lashed at Harry's ghost as he walked across the grounds toward the castle. Ron was standing there and doing a kind of frenzied tap dance. <laughs> he saw Harry and immediately began to eat Hermione and his family. <laughs> Ron's shirt was just as bad as Ron himself. <laughs> if you can't clump happily, I'm going to get aggressive. Confess the reasonable Hermione. That's, that's, a, that's a pretty good start. Yep, that's a pretty good start to this deck here. It's, it's, it's wizards. And you say there's not that many wizards in the deck. There's a few wizards. Why are we playing wizards? We are playing wizards because I was inspired by this old card. Riptide Laboratory. It can add one card or less. Or it can pay two mana. Return a wizard you control to its own hand. And there's a couple of good wizards. Uh, two <laughs> wizards that they can return with this. First of all, Fae Wishes is a wizard. Which is pretty amazing. Baron. Oh. Mm. Mm. Baron, Baron, Le, Baron Le Bush. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Baron Le Bush is pretty amazing with Riptide Laboratory, getting that back to the hand. And also Baron is amazing with Fairy Wishes. But then I thought, can we make this even more bonkers if we have like a million manas? And the answer to that is always yes. So we're gonna play Ulamog. Whenever you cast this spell, exile to target permanence. But then look at this, we have an infinite combo. Because we can play Baron, return our Ulamog, Play him again for 10 manas, then we can return the Baron with the Riptide Laboratory and return him again, and again, and again, and again, then we can play Ulamog until they have no permanence. That's not gonna happen often, but it could happen. So, other than that, we have some Ramp, Guardian Idol, Mindstone, Chromatic Lantern, Solemn Simulacrum, which is also something we might want to bounce with the Baron, I don't know, it might happen. We have Ugin to clear the board. Spark double to copy our Ugin or Ulamog for the Lulz. And that is pretty much like, of course, we have everything that's good and good in the side. We have a lot of life gain, also, by the way. Crypt of Eternals gives one life when it turns bad field raid and found gives two. It's jumping to the game. Celtic image. It's a cool name for a cool man. But can he stand against the wizards? I think against the wizards. Okay. On a black, maybe? Death touch? Typhoid rats again. That's kind of cool, I'm gonna say. Kind of dangerous with that rat. Oh, is it a rat deck? Pack rat? Trespasser's Curse. Enchant player, okay. Whenever a creature enters the battlefield on enchanted player's control, that player loses one life and you gain one life. Oh. That's kind of cool. Never seen this card. So I can't play that many. Wait, I'm not enchanting. But why didn't he? But he is enchanting himself, isn't he? Is he enchanting me with this? Wouldn't it have been better to enchant himself? I think it would have been. I think we just knock him. Draw some cards. Draw some cards. Draw some cards. Oh, a very good shape. Oh, 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 oh. Well, in that case, I think going this. And then we go with a Baron, and we can block this out. But dang, Bouncing Knight. Oh, why did I take one damage from this? Trespasses Curse. Honestly, it could be dangerous. It could be. I mean, if you have a lot of creatures, you have this. 
Dang it. Uh, what do we do now? I think that the... Solemn Simulacrum can go back to him. I think that's it. Then we're gonna spark double our Baron and then Baron the Knight. I'm gonna take two damage from it, I guess, but... Then when it m dies, you may put a minus counter on target creature. I think I'll take it. I'll take that. Don't want to have that happen to us. We'll copy the Baron. We'll return the Baron. Oh, but then we take one damage. And then we're gonna take another damage. Such, okay. Baron down. Return the Knight. Take another damage. 14. Double draw. Oh! Oh! Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Celtic image. We can now start using the laboratory. Oh, but he has a grey merchant. Okay, we're kind of close to dying now, so I guess we need to change our plans a little bit. Uh, okay, well, I guess we block there and we block there. Sure. Because we don't want to die. Now he's gonna kill the Baron, and that's fine. And then, you see, we play this. We go with the Faye Wishes. Wait, we, can, can we play another... Oh, no, we can, okay. Go with the Faye Wishes, granted. We kind of need HP, actually. So I think we just go pick up a plain wide celebration. And no attacks. And then we can also return some barons with the Grave. That could be nice. I want to bounce this, though. I could bounce this. Caged Zombie. Each one loses to life. Oh God, dangerous. Okay, well. We'll return a permanent and gain a load of life. I think the Baron can go back. To the hand. And then, maybe play the Fae, which is how the doctor. Take enough damage. No attacks. Wink. Celtic image. Can he stand against the Wizards? Sacrifice another creature, create X 2 2 black summer creature where X is the sacrifice creature's power. Ooh. Oh! Be a lot of dudes. Okay, can't really attack him. He can't sit away, I guess. That won't do much for him. <laughs> okay, he wishes. Return that thing. Definitely want the search here. Madang. And what do we find? Mass manipulation is not the worst. So that can take over like everything else. And chromatic lantern. No attacks. Double draw. Oh. 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 That's kind of nice. I think we got him now. But he could have, you know, a gray merch or something. It's eight. Devotion. That's a lot. It's gold. Do, do, do. And my Triton. Minus two cards. Oh, he has a Bontus last reckoning. That, that, that's a baller card to have when you only have creatures. Got a cool. okay. How many can we take over? Can we take over? Let's see. It's four. Let's see. We have four here. One, two. Uh, plus three. So we can take over four things. So I guess we take over you and you and... You and you. Bye bye. And that uh, is kind of nice. Now we can smack in. And I think we should do them. I just think we should do them. <laughs> and now we can start producing a rat army. Get back with rats. Oh, and an Ugin, you say. An Ugin and a Spark Dummy. That's kind of nice. Kind of nice. Kill this guy. Boom! Activate this guy. Activate this ability. Then, look at this. Sacrifice the knight. Oh! Oh! <laughs> this is what I get for being greedy, I guess. No blue manas, double baron. Ah, okay. It's fine. It's fine. Alex Notibex. Swamp Gunner Bones. Well, 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 we're just gonna life get him. Just gonna life get him to death. That's our plan. Let's have so much life gain. We simply can't run. Okay, we no sound there. Please. Got a bones and got a bones. Okay, I think we do uh, 
I think we don't mind stuff. Kind of noise. We got the island now. So we can play the Baron if we want to. And return his gun at once. A lot of doodles. A lot of doodle doodles. I think, though, that what we do is just play a solo. Play a solo and block our gunner bones. And then he's gonna return his gunner bones, but it's gonna be slow. It's gonna be very slow to grind this out. Right? Play it off. No, 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 no. no. Someone just got so much value! Mr. Value, okay. Well, pick up another mine stone. And we'll take some damage. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Well. Well, sure. I think we'll have to use the next. Darn this bad boy. Uh, play you. Play you. And now we have some mana on the list. So that's kind of nice. We can black block his playgrounder. And I say that's another one. Like he has. The mask is going to tap. No! No, no. Okay, it's up perfect too. Go down, go down low, but now we're starting to get to uh, the business. Soon. Soon we'll get to the business. Soon. We can solemn symbol a coon. Happy me correctly. Something like this. Solemn symbol a coon. Take that action. I have eye long. Then we could. It's a little bit risky, but we could bear in our own Solemn. Ah, it's probably... It's probably better to bear in this guy. And then next time we're going to turn about That could be good. That could be really good. Uh, we could also sacrifice our Mind Stone to start growing some cars. That could be good. Alex, no Tibex, though. That's gonna take no for an answer. Ask us, come down. Oh, 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 okay. And smacks in. We will kill the play counter. Don't have a seven, but we draw a card. It's that card. It's a good card. That's not a good card, okay. The bones, come on now. Radiant Fountain at least gives us some life, so I guess we'll do that. And. Sacrifice a mind stone. Can find something. Ulamog. <laughs> oh, you don't say Ulamog. Okay, we can play Ulamog next turn. That's kind of good. Yeah, not too sad about this card. Not too sad about it. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo. And 5. Turn to the reassembling. There's the sanitarium also. There's all the skeletons, okay? Ulamog! Ulamog! Take away the gunner bones. And now we have a big dude. Flip out the laboratory. And we can sacrifice these, I guess. Oh, I could have sacrificed one more. If I put down the land and paid with that land, I could have sacrificed one of these and the turn. That would be average bird. Alex, no Dimex. Can he kill the indestructible Ulamon? He can. I'm at five. I'm really close to dying, honestly. Okay. But I can't. Oh! And we can get another Ulamon. I think we start off with. Going a car, though. I see something even better we can do. That is a fair wishes. I mean. <laughs> I mean. Can we say no to double level? I don't, I don't think we can. Granted. And what else do we want? We don't already have. I guess playing like something is kind of good in this situation. So. Put that down, put that away. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. 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 I think this deck is kind of sweet, kind of sweet, kind of sweet. I think this deck is kind of sweet. I just love gaining life from lands. Like this land, probably my new favorite of the Raiden Fountain. I put it in everything, I know. Just so good, just so good. Same with mine, son.
put it in everything. It's so nice. Bono flourishing. Okay. But the Simic Guildgate. I'm playing it. Okay. Okay, I see, sir. What you're doing here? Well, solemn symbol Akrum. I know. I don't know. That's the third. And now then, what are we gonna do next then? We're gonna bury in our own solemn? Draw a card? That seems kind of. Oh, oh, you're gonna have that card, aren't you? I think we can actually pay that. I think we can pay it. We can smack him with this guy. We can play this guy. Return the solemn symbol Akrum for hand. And it's gain some life. Because it's nice. And rock hard. Oh, whoa, forgot about that thing. Ah, oh, didn't pay our taxes. Didn't pay our taxes. At least Ugin can I can't get rid of the treasures, but I can get rid of oh, my girls. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. We're kind of off playing Ugin. We'll decline this. I will decline this. It's getting dangerous. It's getting dangerous. I think I gotta get some of my own medicine here. Ah, that's not good. I'm gonna have to eat. Oh. I mean, if he has the um, the seven mana thing, where which he probably has. Oh, we have all this money now. Okay, we might be fine. We might be fine since we have Ugin. Because I, he didn't have that thing. What's called when he draw both players draw seven cards. He didn't have that card. So. I guess if these guys go away, he will be in the trouble. Uh, resolve, decline. Resolve, decline. Resolve, decline. Smack his face. Bang. Ilando down. Eugene. Minus. One, two, three, four. So good. So good. But it's still, we're not in the clear still, are we? Like, these treasures need to be dealt with, I feel like. That's a lot of ass hanging around there. Okay, Fey wishes though. Elder spell? You have that. Mass manipulation? Oh, ruinous ultimatum. And he buys it. Then he has nothing left, which is Kalgan. It's not the worst for us. Take action? Not the worst, I would say. So, we can grant it. Mirror's Wake is kind of ballers to play, but I don't think we're gonna play that. I think we're gonna play... Oh, pick up the finale. Finale of Revelation. Down with this, down with this, down with this. And then we're gonna draw a lot of cards. And that's gonna be good, I think. Okay. Gate thing. Down with Fey. Return the Fey. Most likely. Most likely. He needs this card. This is kind of a weak card. Okay. Returns to Fey. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Let's see. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So if we draw a land, we can actually untap with this. That would be pretty good. Okay. He goes for the granted. And then. Then what will you pick up? Only one card. Hmm. We could actually. Ah, we don't have black. Ah, we do have black from this. Oh, but not, not, not black. Peer into the abyss. Okay, that's kind of dangerous. I guess this is kind of good though. We can Ulamog away so we can't use that peer. Because he needs black to do it. And we can remove both black sources. This and this, yes. Ulamog! What a main! Unless he has, unless he draws the black. Oh, but he doesn't have enough mana. Well. Fair wishes. Securus root. Oh, then he can get enough. Again, Frackers. Frackers but Nagus. Okay, so next turn he has enough. But we can get rid of that from his hand still. And we're gonna attack him with Ulamog. Uh, so yeah, attack him with both. Lose 20 cards there. Kind of noise. Getting rid of those. What did the X on Lot thing. Okay, he has no more smothering ties. That's good to know. He has some milk. Don't like that. Uh, so, we could now tap like this and 
this and this and not with you with you oh no 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 we need a boot okay tap like this granted and i think we should be able to thought distortion this guy right Swing to get rid of the parent of the abyss also Ooh. exiled super exiled mega exiled okay, hopped like, this card is actually surprisingly useful to have in this armor. Surprisingly. Surprisingly, surprisingly. surprisingly. Oh, it clears the mind, though. I <laughs> think one card or something. In it. The rest, no! <laughs> Not my finale. Ah, it's fine. I can fail, which is back, anyways. And just two hits from Ulamog and he's down, so. Thank you, guys. Yes, oh yes, oh yes, this hell is good. Flames, Radiant Fountain, Resarius, Resarius. Okay, Trashy Map, that's a boss card there, mister. Gotta say, down with the Mind Stone. Down with the Mind Stone. And the basics, of course. That's kind of Mollers, okay. Is it five colors? We'll find out. Solemn Simulacrum. Simulacrum. Take action. I like that Historic Ladder is very, very janky. I mean, there is a limit to how janky decks I can create. Still. <laughs> I mean, I create some really janky decks. You don't often see those decks. Uh, because it's not, like, super interesting to post a deck that loses, like, 100% of the games. With one super obscure combo that I probably never get off. <laughs> but, at some point, maybe. But I completely run out of ideas, I'm gonna start running those decks. Okay, treasure map. It flips it. Okay. Six manas. That's a lot. Encyclopedia. Oh, he's gonna draw a card! Three manas here. No, no, no. I'm gonna save it again. Slavor, the flavor. Uh, we can play Ugin. Could I remove a spell? But I don't think he play it. He does play it. He's played in the smack his face, but Dane. He probably has a removal, but if he doesn't, and we get the spark down there. Oh, let's get this. I gotta be quite noise if we get to do that. Resorius, he could feel the ruin. Destroy my laboratory here. I don't think the laboratory is gonna do much against him, but. He could have, he cannot have, yeah, he could have the Eldest, but I guess he could play it with this, but since he just has one of each basic, it's hard to even understand, like, what is this deck about? It's about, is it also an Ugin deck? It might be, okay, Garouk. Garouk, this time, actually. Okay. Two tutus. And we draw Ulamog. That is kinda good. Kinda good. Okay. Chromatic Lantan. It would be sweet to win. Let's go. I think we just need to finish the game. The Garuk. We could do this on zero also. No, 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 no. We have two. We have two which can alter. That would be. Ooh, we could get double ultimates off with this. I mean, that would be... That would be hilarious. Double Ugin, double ultimate. It's now when he release, uh, releases... When he shows the Eldest, by the way. He's been holding this entire time. Feo wishes Eldest spell. Oh, it's gonna sting. He has it, but we have Ulan on though, so... Like, this card is... This card is really good, I feel like. I mean, it's 10 mana, but... I <laughs> shot that difficult with 10 mana, nothing. Essentially nothing. Okay. Block, block. I mean, yeah, I hope for his own sake that he can deal with one of these at least. Okay, we double draw. Take the Dragon Yesh. Take the Dragon Yesh. And Resorius. Oh, is he gonna get double ultimated? Because that's gonna hurt for him. Okay, Solemn. Yeah, he's all. You're in trouble, sir. Sir, sorry, sir. You're in trouble, sir. That's all I can say. Roll. Uh, that's that's dangerous and all. 
And these guys. <laughs> these guys are just kind of angry, honestly. Okay, we gain seven life. We're gonna put some permanents. Okay, we're not gonna put down the Ulamogs. We want to play the Ulamogs. Spark double, though. Fine with that. He can copy the Ugin. Yep. <laughs> and find another land. Why not? Why not another ultimate? Why not another one? Okay. Okay. Uh, I think I want to have the Baron in hand. So I'll do this instead. So I might want to return my combo, you know. Might want to. Take that action. I Londo. And, you know, play an Ulamog. This can go, and this can go. And can we play another Ulamog? Can almost play another level. Okay, we return the level. Because we surely wanted to play him again next time. Surely. So we smack his face. Smack his face. Shabang. Should I get the third? Maybe I do get a third. <laughs> I'll be so bad about this, but... Ah, this feels so good at the same time. What can I do? Ghost. Okay, now the plan is in motion. Now we just Ulamog exile everything he has. That's kind of nice. And we have a stack of Ugans. <laughs> stack of Ugans. I feel way too good about this game. Way too good. Resorius. I think it's time to scoop Oh. Man, shout out! Man, man, man. Thank everyone so much for watching. Especially thank you, of course, to our members. If you also want to become a member, you check out the join button next to the subscribe button. If you want to check out the Patreon link in the description. Thanks so much for watching, and thank you so much to Adam Alexis, Simon Lauer, Rob Dick Cox, Herman M, The Soft Pillow, Alex Mike, and Antonio Nissen. Laser set the stun. Michael W. Topless investments. W. Newt. 1978. Peach Gold. Sean Stevens. Gabriel Juvenal. Way. Mesmog One. Ye old basses. Tai Tai. Yulai Moonlight Star. Drake at 2000. Jurassic Fort. Invoke Legion. Yon Dongen. Gesusaki. Own 77. Ellie Curtis. Noah VH. MC Hermes. Fumiaki. Kinoshita. J Cap. Steve Dominski, Sky Surfer Zero, Tim Dutton, Jake Danley, The McDuncan, Ralgan, Chase Closed, Honsa Kos, Agron Reborn, Ramen Noodles for me, Nethervex, Musketeer, Tom Q, Named Epta, The Lurk of Dimlit Knight, Stricker Mike, Metasaurus, Yuan Tu Ying, Michael Capito, Vincent Podet, Paul Robert Miller, Anthony Nixon, Ninja Astral, Optimus, Dan McShark, Pocky Yu, Magic Pistol Man, Seppi1310, Martin Newman, Catherine Leuchtgeld, That's Mr. God to You, Jake Palmer, Thomas Schwartz, Kyle Hoff, Judy Robinson, Robert Montgomery, Salim Proctor, Jason Ellison, Zach Coyla, QGL889, Some Call Me George, Paris Hammond, Bill Murray, Charlene Eaton, Kyle Wedgwood, Matt D, Patrona Bavarier, Robert Barker, Adam Jacob, Fernando Vizu, Left, Robert Lewis, Dr. Legos, Link is Weak, Verocta, Sante John, Geek, General Educator, Embracer of Knowledge, Joseph Zuninga, Nate TMI, Shamanix, <laughs> Matthias Porley, Carlos Odenas, Simon Fairley, Tim Tam the Me Man, Ivan Miller, Chance Kennedy, Matthew Ho Howell, William Cunningham, Dan Goodsell, Aaron Noble, Drew Stiles, Adam Alexis, Matthew Goggins, Betsuma, Serge Karamaro, Freeman Stephenson, Brandon Dobbs, DBK Drummer, Rainbow Cake, Eventum Tantum, Piotr Stalorch, Ninja Long Gnome, Infinite Draw, Dr. Jaden, Javier Diaz, Adam Ruth, Barbara McKenley, 7 guys 777 Big Bob MG, Patrick Henning, Liquidy, Thanatos, Nesmoth, Truman, Yellowbean, Patrick Parks, Martin Newman, Jonathan Burgos, James Hazel, Daniel Williams, Harshit Singh, Eat It, Alexander G. Valencia, Lochinator, Travis Markley, Grinning Demon, Frank Sherwood, Farron, Sky, Disquietus, I Ate My Neighbor, Yuto Ayase, Christopher Tonkin, Guadalupe, Hernandez, Bam Bam, Kevin Xie, Yoda for Sale, But With Us, Trunks305, in KC, and Michael Brown. You guys are amazing. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. And see you. Thank you so much for watching. If you want some free tacos, you can check out the videos on the I Just Kidding. It's not a Just More of a video. There's no free tacos, I think. Or maybe you can give me some good tacos by checking out the Patreon link down below.